we've seen a dramatic increase in DUI drug prosecutions. Even five years ago, it was about 1% of our practice. It's now 20%, maybe a little bit more actually. And it's not street drugs. It's by and large prescription medications. As a generation, the baby boomers get a little bit older, we see more and more prescription drug prosecutions. And it has a lot to do with basically two points. One is whether or not they're taking their medication as prescribed in accordance with their doctor's instructions. And, and two, whether or not that medication causes impairment. And so what we want to do is analyze both of those pretty significant issues in order to help our clients. Because if someone's been taking their medication for 15 years and it's the exact same dose and they know whether or not they can drive or not, the problem is that the officers, they don't know that. And so there's a tendency to err on the side of arresting people. It's actually an interesting trend that we've seen and it's one that I see more and more and more coming down the pike.